Thank you so much. <laughs> yeah, hurry back inside. And with the temperatures as cold as they are, many of us are putting a new car feature to good use. Yeah, we're talking about remote starting cars to warm them up before we get inside. Brandon Lewis verifies whether or not letting your car run can actually hurt the engine. Our sources are the U.S. Department of Energy, Firestone Complete Auto Care, Smart Motors Toyota in Madison, Wisconsin, and Napa Auto Parts. Gas-powered cars need oil to keep their engines lubricated. When you start a car, an oil pump circulates the oil in less than a minute. If you let your car idle to warm up the cabin, then the oil will slowly drain away from the key components since the engine isn't moving the car. Our sources say this leads to more friction, which causes wear and tear and could eventually shorten the life of your engine. Instead, our sources recommend driving about 30 seconds after starting your car because the engine will warm up faster when the car is being driven. In the past, cars needed to warm up for several minutes to avoid stalling because they used a carburetor. Nearly all cars built in the last 30 years now use electronics to ensure engines get the right combination of air and fuel to run no matter what the temperature is outside. So, yes, warming your car could damage the engine. There is one exception. If you drive an electric vehicle, you may want to warm up your car before unplugging it because heating the cabin uses battery power, which can shorten your range. Whether you are verify, I'm Brandon Lewis.